this video is for you if you are looking for a smoke detection alarm Hey guys what's up it's Jatin here welcome to robotics.io you might have seen this safety device a lot of different places like malls school offices and banks if you are new to this channel press the subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon so let's talk about the components required for making this brand new project mq2 smoke sensor buzzer arduino nano LED OLED display breadboard here i am using breadboard small connecting wires and arduino nano cable i am sharing the process code and circuit diagram the code and circuit diagram link is already given in the description you can check it once the sensor which we are using here that is mq2 gas sensor this sensor can detect different type of gases like methane, butane, LPG and smoke. It's time to upload the code. Make sure before uploading the code, you have to download these two libraries. First one is Adafruit GFX. Second one is Adafruit SSD 3006. Let me show you how to download these libraries. Click on sketch, include library and manage libraries it will take a little bit of time okay now in the search bar you have to write adafruit gfx and the second library you have to download its latest version it is already installed in my system so i am not installing it again in the same way you have to search adafruit ssd 1306 and this library is also downloaded in my system you have to select the latest version and click on install so in this way you have to download these two libraries now let's move on towards the next part so here you can see that this is the overall code of smoke detection alarm we are using one led that is red led a buzzer and you can see that the smoke sensor its analog pin is connected to pin number a2 sensor threshold value is there that is 250 you can see that this is the code if analog sensor is greater than sensor threshold so sensor threshold value is 250 so if the sensor value is greater than 250 so automatically the buzzer will start ringing and the light it will start let's upload the code click on tools select Arduino Nano you can also use Arduino mega or Arduino uno tools com6 that's it now you just have to click on upload and the code will start uploading now let's move on towards the next part we'll test that how it is working Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. I'll see you again in the next day with a brand new video. In the same way there are different MQ series gas sensors are also available in the market like MQ3, MQ4, MQ5, MQ6 and so on. So these sensors are detecting the different different type of gases so based on your availability based on your requirement you can buy the gas sensor accordingly you can also join our discord community there you can just hang out with your new friends you can read ebooks related to robotics electronics circuit and a lot of cool things you can do there so the link is already given in the description you can just check it once